isn't the best video I've ever done because it's not very entertaining. So let me kind of sum this up. Thursday, I left Sacramento at about 9.30 or so in the morning. Went and played at Tax City Thursday night, uh, which was a lot of fun. Hung out with Sonny, had just kind of like some loose conversations about the business industry and kind of like, what are they, what are you doing? Have you experienced this? You know, how have you responded to like the pandemic situations and all that stuff? Because uh, Sonny's hand, hands down, definitely one of my business mentors. Friday, I went and hung out with an old army friend of mine who I hadn't seen in years. Then went to KWA, had a meeting, went to SpeedQB office, their new office, and had a meeting, kind of like hung out slash hung out slash picked up one of our uh, one of my field's orders. The SpeedQB office is dope, man. That thing looks like a, like a cool skate shop. Let's go really... It's not surprising to see the kind of stuff that they're putting out and how creative and kind of innovative it is and how colorful it is. Because when you go into their office, it's kind of the same thing. Like it's a very fun, relaxed, creative environment. Then after that, I went to N1 and further trashed my knees while playing because Thursday at Tax City, I totally <laughs> my knees up. And I didn't stop the next day at N1. N1 was dope. N1 was one of, my, one of the highlights of my vacation kind of, because I got to see Ryan, my homie from his TTG team. I got to see Josh uh, from down south, uh, Jeffrey and Sam on trim, all the N1 homies. I had a lot of fun there. Went and hung out with my army buddy again, because again, I haven't seen them in years. Saturday morning, so today, right now it's Saturday, it's about six in the evening. Saturday morning I got up at like six, no, excuse me, 5.30, got to N1 at about 6.30, because the whole purpose for me coming down was to help out with and observe the latest KWA fight night, which is kind of why this vlog is so boring, because everything I did at N1 is technically under an, a non-disclosure agreement. So like, I couldn't really get any footage, I can't really talk about the matches and how super dope, uh, there's some interesting twists and turns in there for sure, but I didn't even film in there because it's an NDA event. After that, we had, if you follow my Instagram, you knew how wild it was getting. Uh, we all had Korean barbecue with the KWA staff, with the SpeedQB guys, the SYG guys, all that. So I've had, oh my God. From there, I'm now, I just picked up, let's see if you can see this. Just picked up about three, about 3,500 bucks worth of e-bike stuff. And I'm just gonna death run it back up to Sacramento. So that's cool. Uh, it's about 6.15 in the evening. I'll probably get home, let me lower this a little. I'll probably get home around one in the morning or so with some breaks and you know, maybe see what traffic looks like. Probably get home about one in the morning, take a nap, go to my field and go to work. Ah! Uh, so that's basically the summation of this whole vlog. And everything is such a terrible video. I don't even know why I'm gonna do this. So everything for me is mostly just a series of like, arriving and departing narratives and kind of like what I did. Like there's not a whole lot of B-roll because I've been ridiculously busy since I left Sacramento. Like I haven't had, and it's all by myself. Good news is my new little rig, my vlogging rig, you know, my little mod, my, you know, road mic and all that stuff. That all worked real well. But if this is an entertaining video, it's because I was busy as shit. So there's that. And it was just, I, you know, I didn't bring the girlfriend or any, you know, it's just me. Uh, so that's it. I hope you like this kind of shit travel vlog of arrivals and departure descriptions. And, uh, fuck you. Break number two. Uh, break number one just consisted of my fat ass going to Carl's Jr. through Flag City, because Flag City is usually, like, a break for me. Uh, right now I'm in Santa Nella. It is 11 o'clock, so I had set an alarm for, like, 6 a.m. to pick up my rental at 7.30. My truck. Yeah, about my truck. Anyway. And I didn't actually get up. Well, like I, left, I, I left the house at like 9.30, all right? So, like, kind of off. You ever go to the bathroom, one of those truck stop travel centers, and two grumpy old white guys are talking about wearing masks in California? That was weird. I just peed and got out. Stop number three. I think I'm in 
Gustine somewhere. I don't know. And I've basically been listening to nothing but Dan Locke videos for like the last hour or so, 45 minutes to an hour, just listening to sales videos, closing sales videos, all that cool stuff. Oh, cool. Carson and Gassing. I don't care. Uh, so I think I'm going to start doing more sales and business based content. Uh, mostly because I don't really fancy myself too much of a player anymore. So I don't really play. I manage a field. I deal with retail. I deal with marketing strategies. I do, I, yo, I've done retail consultations with businesses other than my own. I've done field consultations with fields in other states, like on the other side of the country. So apparently like in the business world of airsoft people actually listen to what the fuck i say because i guess it works all right so anyway, i'm gonna i want to do more sales based content specifically i want to start helping like sales associates at airsoft shops learn how to sell because there's no real sales training for airsoft they just sort of throw you in there and i hope you know the difference between a DSG and an SSG and an irregular AEG, good luck. Very, very powerful title because people go on YouTube, they want to find out. Well, I'm definitely in LA because there's traffic. Uh, it is about a little after four, it's about 4.07. I'm about 30 minutes away from Tax City. They open at six, I think, six or seven. So I'm just gonna jump in there, play around a bit, find a hotel. I didn't, I just sort of drove down here. I didn't really make like plans. I just sort of showed up. So I'll probably just get the hotel I always go to around there. And tomorrow at three, I'm supposed to be at the KWA office. So before that, I'm gonna see uh, if I could just swing by the Speed QB and just be like, hi, the end. How are you? Good, how about you? Great, thank you. Caber, who the f are you, nerd?